Hello Aqua friends, welcome to my channel. Today I have another Christmas card tutorial for you. This little ornament is a very fast, easy to do. Starting off, I had masked the bulb with contact adhesive paper and I'm wetting the background. We're gonna work wet on wet for the background. So the colors that I used here was Quinacridone Red mixed with the ISO Yellow Deep to create this peachy color and a little bit of neutral tint. And I'm just kind of doing some circular bokeh type uh, look to, to the left hand side of the paper. I never really followed any one specific picture. I just was looking through some reference photos on Pixabay and um, there are a lot of ornaments that have the bokeh look so I just decided to do a quick little loose tree and I'm putting in my sap green here for the tree with the bokeh background and the bulb. It just was a very easy to do and very cute little Christmas card. I'm using shadow green and I'm just putting in some of the darker underbrushes of the tree. Just very loose. I'm not looking for detail at all. Just very soft because we want the Christmas ornament to be the center of attention. Putting in a little more sap green for it to be darker. Now I'm drying it just a little bit. We want the sheen to start disappearing so that I can do the bokeh effect on the right hand side. So any craft sponge will work, any sort of daubers. So I just want this to be very light and pretty. I'm not going too crazy on the bokehs, but I'm adding a few there to the left hand side of the paper. Unfortunately, as you can see, my dauber was, had a little paint on there, so I'll have to try to scrub out that little gray mark that I have on one of the circles. And just a few reflection lights in the trees. I'm just gonna do a few of them here in the tree. So I dried the paper a little bit more there so that I could get a little bit of definition for some of the pine needles on the tree. I'm using a script liner brush, also known as a rigger brush. Uh, let the whole thing dry and I'm wetting my bulb before I put my color in there. And I'm using my favorite color which is aqua. <laughs> kind of like an aqua color. The, the paint color that I used is uh, a peacock blue. And then for the darker areas I used Prussian blue for the shadowy areas on the bulb. Fun fact, I did this video twice because I forgot to press record again. I keep making these rookie mistakes and I did not get the footage of me painting the bulb. <laughs> but that's okay, now I have two Christmas cards that I can send out instead of one.
After letting that dry, I'm going to touch up the shape of the ball because I'm a perfectionist and I'm cheating and using a pen. If you want to use paint, that's fine. I'm also drawing in the fine wire because I know that would be a disaster and not look straight if I tried to do that. <laughs> and of course, um, I went over my lines there, so I am just lifting the blue in those areas, just touching it up. Okay, I'm adding in the top of the bulb, the little metal piece, putting in just a very watery mixture of neutral tint. Adding my little loop. I'm adding in the lines just very lightly. And then I'm signing my painting and we are done. Let me know in the comments below what you think about this tutorial and if you're going to give it a try. I think it's very pretty and festive, and I will talk to you guys next week. Bye for now.